We're back in it. Come on. We just need one more. And the scare is over. Oh, look at that on the volley as well. Lovely goal. Hello and welcome back to Curb FM and another episode of the Amsterdam Wonder Kids on Football Manager 2020. And today we're bringing you the second leg of the Champions League where we take on Luda Gretz and try and overturn a 3-1 deficit going into that one. And then we're going to take on our rivals. One of the teams that will be challenging us for the league title in the domestic season, PSV. Uh, of course, we've played them before in this save. We beat them in the Johan Cruyff Charles, and hopefully we can beat them again. Uh, we did come back from behind in that game. This was obviously in the first episode with two great goals from Raz van Marin, scoring two in four minutes from outside the box to put us into the lead. So hopefully you can step up again today. As you can see on the screen now, I'll show the highlights from the game that you missed, which was against FC Groningen. Raz van Marin again, doing what he does best, scoring from outside the box, putting us into the lead early on, eight minutes in. And then Quincy Promes gets a brace to make it 3-0 at home at the Johan Cruyff Arena. And today, if we win 3-0, we go through to the next round of the Champions League. We only actually need a 2-0 victory. And I'm confident, um, obviously, they did upset us last time. Uh, so, you know, I'll try not to underestimate them. Uh, so the team that we're going in with is what I see as our strongest team, maybe apart from the striker. We're going to start Huntelaar. We need them goals. He's got the 18 finishing. And yeah, I think that's the best option. I think he's going to score us a couple of goals today. Uh, we've moved Veltman onto the bench as well and brought in Alvarez. As you saw in the replay of the last game against Groningen. Uh, his stats are going down here. Let's ignore that. He moved from centre-back over to right-back and actually got a, a decent assist. Uh, so that could be an option going into the second half if we're not in the lead already. Today's lineup is we've got a Niner in goal, Martinez and Alvarez in the centre-back roles just in front of them. We've got Tagliafico on the left, we've got Blin just in front and Dest on the right. In the middle of the park, in the centre-mid positions, we've got Marin and Van der Beek making quite the partnership. They've played together quite a bit this season. And then on the inside forwards roles, we've got Promes and Zayek. And up top, we've got, hopefully, the man that can win this game for us, Huntelaar. We'll be passionate and say, I know a lot of you will be keen to avenge what happened last time. And the lads look up for it. And let's just give them a bit of uh, passionate faith while we're here. And yeah, it looks like the team talk's gone well. Well, let's do it. Come on, we're at home. I think we can win this one. I've got an early chance here. 20 seconds in. Van der Beek and it's a save from Renan. An early opportunity for Ajax and the corner ball in. And he doesn't see a shot on target. But we've still got the ball though. Looking to push forward once again. And yeah, nothing comes of that. Saying that though, we've still got the highlight going. And Promes is on the left hand side. Tagliafico, Promes now. Marin, Van der Beek. Out wide to death with the width. Ah, I can't find a way through there. And we've got another highlight here with Tagliafico going back to Marin. Marin across to Des. And Zayek finds Des again. Can he find the ball in? And he has. Huntelaar nearly gets on the end of it. Back into Zayek. And it's gone wide. A goal kick for Luda Gretz. Can we win it straight back? And we have Tagliafico brings it down. And he's given it away. Martinez there. Messing about. It's all right though. Uh, Dest on the right hand side finds Van der Beek now blind. Marin across to Tagliafico. Promes can he shoot? And it's a great save from Renan. I think we're like we should be in the lead here already. Zayek can he find the ball in? Dest across to Promes and it's gone wide again. Promes has taken a knock apparently. We'll just leave it for this highlight. And Marin shoots and it's just gone way wide. I think what we're going to do is bring on Bandy for his d debut. Now Ludogrets looking for another goal. This would make it 4-1 if they can score and it's a good save from Onana. And they've got a corner though. The danger is not finished just yet. And they've whipped it in and it, nothing comes of it. Can we win the ball back? And we have Martinez heads it out to Zayek and now plays it up to Huntelaar who loses it. Luckily it's gone to the keeper. And nearly 
nearly another mistake there. And I was just playing it out of the back once again. Zayek across the bandy, off the bench. Can he find a ball in? Tagliafico. Marin shoots and he scored another absolute banger from outside the box. 1-0 here. 3-2 on aggregate to Luda Gretz. And we're back in it. Come on. We just need one more. And the scare is over. Oh, look at that on the volley as well. Lovely goal. And now Zayek intercepts the pass. Bandy, can he find someone? Ah, oh, Blin from outside the box as well. What a goal. Come on, 2-0. Three all on aggregate. We're cruising. What a ball. What a goal. Another first time shot. They're trying to find a way through, but Blind intercepts the pass from the goalie there. Now we're just passing it around the back a little bit in the midfield. Now Tagliafico, Bandy, finds Marin and he's shot again. A brace for Razvan Marin. Fifth goal of the season, second of the game. Look at this. Bang, right into the bottom left corner. Lovely stuff. Panic is over. <laughs> and looks like we're going to go through to the next round. I think it was Dunkirk or someone else that we're going to face. I'll quickly check that in a second. Let me just watch this highlight first. And will it be ours? I think it is. And it's right hand side with Dest. Just passing it around now. Just to, you know, that's fine. I'm happy with that. Out to Tagliafico. He's going to look for the cross. Couldn't get a ball in. Now Blind. Now Van der Beek out to Tagliafico again. And he looks for Huntelaar. Huntelaar couldn't get in the end of it. And now it's cleared. And they've got a chance. And it's a save by Anana. If they score here, it will mean... That it goes to extra time as it stands if they score. And Death pulling the strings out on that right hand side. Is he kind of going to find the ball in? Zayek finds Marin and he scored again. First time shot from outside the box. And it's a hat trick for Raz Van Marin. What a player he is proving to be. Absolute bomb from outside the box there. And it's a lovely goal 4 0 now here at the Johan Cruyff Arena. And we are at half time. And it, as I was saying before, it is Dunkirk or Maribor that we will be facing. And currently, as it stands, we're going to be going through to face Dunkirk from the Republic of Ireland. And do we mix it up or do we just leave it as it is? I feel like going into the game against PSV, maybe we could rest a couple of people. Um, Marin has done his job today. Um, maybe we just take him off. Yeah, we're just going to let's see where Blin can play in that centre. Yeah, we're going to put him on. We're just going to move this role back to a deep line playmaker now, just on support. We're just going to bring on Veltman for Marin and move him back into the centre of defence and move Martinez forward into the deep line playmaker role. Um, we might even just drop these two back as well. Um, put them on. We're going to put Dest on attack and Tagliafico on full back support. Uh, just to shore things up at the back. And it looks like Dest has taken a knock. He's gashed his lower leg. So we're going to have to make another change. Not ideal. Uh, but we're just going to move Veltman over to that right-hand side into his natural position, put him on support fullback, and bring on Kick Pieri into that left-hand side. And Dest has an opportunity to create something maybe before he goes off with his gashed leg. Um, but we've gone out to the left-hand side, back across to Dest. Now Dest again. Puts a good ball in, but Huntelaar just can't get on the end of anything today, it looks like. Martinez wins it back, though, and Zayek shoots, and it's way wide. As the time ticks down now, we've only got five minutes remaining. I'm pretty sure we've done it, and I'm really pleased with that. And Luda Gretz, though, they're still looking for an opportunity. Can they get two in the last minute plus stoppage time? He plays a good ball across there to Tawafa. He finds Ikoku and Jorginho shoots and it's a good save by Anana keeping the lead as it stands. And it's a goal from the corner. And we've only got three and a half minutes remaining. And Luda Gretz there putting themselves back into the tie. They only need one more goal. I can't believe it. Please don't. No. Jesus. What was that? Don't mess about. What is going on? Right, what is happening? What is happening? Pause. We're going to move Blin back. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know whether going super defensive is going to backfire here. 
but we're just going to go in like this now. Um, let's just quickly change the pass into short. Uh, we don't want to look for the overlap. We don't really want to play our defence either. Uh, let's just go in much shorter and slow it down a little bit. Let's just try and get through this tie. Uh, can we maybe go just defensive there and time waste? Let's do that too. Come on. We've only got a minute left. Less than a minute now. Not even a minute. We've got minus 30 seconds left. And it is a win. A little bit of a scare there at the end, but... And the Quincy Promise injury isn't a major one. He's only going to be out for a day. Nothing coming up about deaths. Looks like that gash leg wasn't anything serious. Um, so yeah, let's get into the PSV game now. And hopefully we can pick up another win away from home this time. Okay, we're here at the PSV game now. And I'm tempted just to go the same again. It's only been a few days since the last game though. So it might be worth just making a couple of changes. Yeah, I think we're just going to do this. I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to start Neres actually and Tadic. Other than that, I'm pretty sure I'm just going to leave it. Uh, Tagliafico not looking exactly the fittest at the minute. He's got 88 overall condition, 98 match sharpness though. So yeah, I think, you know, he could come off at half time, but we're just going to stick with it. So just the two changes, David Neres and Tadic. And other than that, everything else remains the same. Come on. I'm just going to go in calm this time. I'm just going to say enjoy yourself tonight. Um, passionate faith. Passionate faith. Faith of passionate. Now today is our first time in the away kit. We're in the green and orange today. Taking on PSV who are in the red and black. And Van der Beek shoots. And it's nearly a goal there. 11 minutes in. We've got a corner. He couldn't find anyone there. And it's just rolled out for a throw in from the corner. Poor. Now PSV, looking to get their revenge after the last time, after we cost them the shawl. And Bergwin has scored. A good ball from Dumfries there. Just look at this, too easy. Look at our defence all over the place. And he just has to slot it past the keeper. It's 1-0. Not great start. We were top before this match. What has happened there? Whoa. The, the defence are all over the place. And now Bruma shoots and he's hit the bar. I'm just going to drop the wing backs to full backs here because I think the, the defense is not solid enough as it is. We seem to be all over the place. And um, we're also going to put him on full back support. I think that might be a bit of a weakness, especially against the bigger teams. Um, the line of four, just, well, there is no line. That's the problem. There should be a bit more of a defensive line this time. Uh, but they have won it back, Pereiro. Can we get back in time? Malin puts it wide. And another free kick. And PSV. Steven Bergwin again for his second goal of the game. And it's just too easy for them. Maybe this is our opportunity to pull one back. Dest, can he find the ball in? David Neres finds Blind. Out wide to Tagliafigo. Come on, find someone. Blind. Dest. Marin. <sighs> That's the way you want him, just outside the box. And now Ajax go again. Van der Beek. Finds the ball to Promes. What can he do? He finds Tadic. Tadic turns and shoots. And it's over the bar and over the keeper. And it's half time here at the Phillips Stadium. This is an important team, so we're going to have to get aggressive. Show me something else in the second half. They seem motivated. They look fired up. Will it make a difference? I've got a tactic in reserve, this one. This is more what Ajax play in real life. I think we might switch to it, you know. Van der Beek looking anxious. So we're going to have to take him off, I think. Uh, maybe for Zayek, who can just go in behind the striker. Uh, we'll put him on support there. And um, we're going to put David Neres on attack. Try and push these two into the box. Um... Tagliafico on a yellow might be worth taking him off but I'm just going to leave it for now he's our best left back can we create an opportunity with this reserve tactic that we haven't actually tried before but it's been sitting there they have been training it so they should be used to it and Marin shoots and can't quite do it again I'm just looking at the team here the PSV team Dumfries is knackered on that right hand side so we're just going to maybe focus play down the left hand side for now 
take advantage of the tired legs. Uh, see how that goes. We need someone on that left-hand side. And we're going to move Blind over. And just move him up there. Just for now. Put him on support. And uh, bring on Kick Pieri. And move Martinez into that position. It's a bit lopsided, but we need to focus that left-hand side for now while their right-back is knackered. Across to David Neres. Back to Martinez. Finds Dest. Dest, can he find a ball in? Across to Marin now. Holds it, he stops it from going out for the throw-in and Blinz give it away, but we have won it straight back through Alvarez. We're attacking once again. Marin finds Zayek. Out to Blind. Can we find a ball in? Promes? Come on. Zayek! Oh, that should have been it. That should have been it. Pieri across the Dest. Neres finds Martinez across the Dest again. Dest is, seems very active in these matches. And Zayek scores. Come on. Good ball from Neres there. Dest just one twos with David Neres. And they eventually create the space, draw the two defenders in, and then leaves the space open for Zayek to put the ball in the back of the net. 20 minutes remaining here. Can we find the equaliser? Another highlight. It looks like it might be theirs unless we can win it back. Bruma cuts inside and he scored. Fair play, that was a good goal. Just 3-1 here in Eindhoven. Bruma with his second goal of the season. And he's done well there. He's completely done the defender. And smashes it near post. Good goal. Took it well. Dumfries has just come off, so we're just going to not focus the left as much. Uh, we're going to look for the over overlap on both sides now. Um, push Death forward there. And yeah, we're going to bring on Hunsalar as well. Just to play the last 10 minutes. Tell him we've got faith. He looks to gain confidence there. It's good to see, but... Might just be too late. That's the problem. And Berwin with the free kick. Mitroglou has scored a goal from outside the box. The Greek god. <laughs> Kostas Mitroglou. Had him on a AEK Athens save last year. He's a great player and he's done it again. And it looks like it's going to be an emphatic defeat here in Eindhoven. And the board and the fans are going to be on our back about this. This is not good. A five goal thriller. Unfortunately, the five goals weren't in our favour. I'm just going to say I'm not pleased. That is not good enough, lads. It's not good enough. But hey, the, the league is really heating up now. We're only three games in. We've got six points. We won our first two games. But when we've come up against the tough teams, we've struggled. And when we beat them in the shield, it wasn't exactly emphatic either. So... We've got we've got some work to do here. Um, I'm not sure when I'm going to come back for the next episode. I don't think I'm going to show the Dunkirk first leg at least. I'll see how the first leg goes. If we're struggling, hopefully we're not, I'll come back for the second leg. If it looks like it's going to be close. Um, but if not, I'm going to probably come back for the Feyenoord and the FC20 game. So if you're excited for that and you've enjoyed the episode, make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe for more. Football Manager 2020 content. Make sure you turn the notifications on as well. And until next time, peace.